All right. The one thing about not playing people you know, I would love to see like a speed CT, JJ, etc. play these settings with its meaning something. Well, SMG says no. <laughs> you cannot play these settings in rank together. You can play it in friends, but then you risk getting teamed hard. Usually goes that way. People know you're a threat, so they make sure to eliminate you first. It's basically the same principle as why I don't play with checkmark on in ranked. You know, JJ did a Play With Friends game on his channel, and I joined it. I killed two players, and JJ was in voice chat with the other guy that was left, and they just ganked up on me. <laughs> so I don't join those anymore. Yeah, these blizzards attract people. They attract people like crazy. These two make multiple people cap in there. That's a bummer. Where do I go though? Burgundy, I guess. It's a decent cap. It's like my only option. I hope no one is in Gascony. If no one is in Gascony or Finland, that would be great for me. But red caps in Iceland. No Iceland, no win, guys. Hey, Yasha. And white has his cap in Hungary. So we know where four of the caps are, we don't know where yellow's cap is. There's a chance that blue's cap is on Gascony. And if it is, it kind of ruins our early game. We won't be able to get a bonus. Because I was going first and I picked my cap before red to prevent him to go for London cap. And he decided to go for Iceland, which is kind of... Yeah, I guess. So I think yellow and blue or yellow and purple are touching caps. That's why he's only taking a card with his troops elsewhere, not with his caps. Purple is playing it smart, not overextending, 5 on 3 is not 100%, he understands that. Now the question is, do we see blue pop out of here? It's gonna be the deciding factor, oh and he added over there, nice, so we get all this for ourselves, nice. And he's going in North Africa, so his cap maybe on Nalud? No, he added way to, to less troops on the left side. He had a 9 there. Okay. Um, let's make this a 6, we can fortify one over.
Let's give the fist bumps too wide to show we are friendly and uh, do we risk it? Oh baby, yes. Oh baby, oh baby, no, 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 no. Do we risk it for the biscuit? Six. Nah, I think we chill for one turn. Maybe that will bite us in the ass and probably add in there. That could happen. I wanted to fortify one over. I didn't want to have a six cap when red gets eight. And if you don't filter the lobbies, people get the idea. Yeah, let's roll his cap. <laughs> so, you know. And White is aggressively getting territories over there. He doesn't have it yet, but... Yep. I think Yellow may be over here. Or in Russia. I have not seen him attack at all. Hello, Sir Louis. How are you doing? I hope you have a great day. Puts everything down there. Nice. Good for me. Good for me. Does purple finish the bonus on this turn? How much does he pull back? Oh. Oh, honey. Oh, honey. Hmm. But white will see it if I do it, right? White will see it. Hmm. Well, I need to make sure I get this. Right, and then I have 11. Yeah, I guess that works. That's that's super fine. I can pull this tree over there, should be okay. I expected to lose way more, to be honest. I always do. We will have to watch out for red from behind us. I think yellow is in Russia. I hope someone breaks white. I hope no one allows him to hold Eastern Europe. Oh, oh, that's where yellow's cap is. And he loses eight. He has six left and he has to spread it across two caps and blue is going before me. Ooh. But red finished Iceland, UK and Scandinavia. Maybe I didn't do it need to do it that turn, huh? That's a bummer.
Hello, Werner. <laughs> Your name is spelled Werner. Like, it's a German name, by the way. Werner. I'm good, how are you? I just rolled a purple 4 cap, and then yellow came out of Naples with a 16. I guess that's where his cap is. So no one is breaking white over there, that's, that's an issue. And I have red behind me. Well, not necessarily, but, you know, it is what it is. And blue is not taking yellow's cap. Purple went offline after he lost his cap. So how much is... Realistically, if red has Scandinavia, UK and Iceland, he's getting 13. So I need to make sure to fortify... 9. Let's make it an 8 and then fortify the 2 over. Should be fine. Oh. I guess I have to play more careful now. Oh, only seven. He did not finish UK or Iceland. That's nice. White's going to start with 20, though. That's an issue. He's going to come down here. Why it's not going for me yet? What are the tactics for capitals? Well, in this map, you have to play it like it's fixed before the cards come in high enough to matter. So you have to play like seven turns of fixed. And you either have a good spawn where you have a bonus or you're doomed to take a card and pass till you have an opportunity to go for a kill if you read the map well enough. Yellow also bought it. Yep, he bought it. Apparently, the leaderboard number one is a hacker right now. I'm gonna have to be careful. Because white is getting huge and red is setting up to go for my cap. So I wanna be ready for that. White's getting 28 means he has Russia, and red keeps fortifying towards my camp. White is attacking a lot. I guess he's attacking down there. He may even kill blue on accident. And we will see the bot break us now. I hope it goes into white, but... Yeah, 
It is what it is. And it breaks even more. Okay, so how do I... How do I break white now? Hmm, I cannot break white. I hope red realizes that. Yeah, apparently it's very easy to do that. But it's stupid, right? It's it's such an easy game and it should be played for fun. I don't know why people... What heck? I... Oh, he's breaking white. Good. I uploaded a video on YouTube. Yesterday, which shows... People hacking. Or one guy hacking, at least. He had a troop count hack. If you scroll down in the stream, you have a YouTube button you can click and then the latest video, I guess. And if you scroll down in the comments, you see 27 for white. So why are you stacking on my cap, dude? He's gonna roll it. I can tell you that. Red is stacking so much on my cap. While white is getting huge. Yeah, why is steamrolling this game? I have a red idiot on my ass. At least he's getting the worst trades, but he has all of this. So that's rough. That's very rough. Yeah. I need to give up this cap. And hopefully purple doesn't set. I need red to do something. Purple holds West Africa, huh? At least he doesn't set. So I get a double set if I kill him. This is a tough one, guys. Oh boy. So I'm getting the 12th trade. Um, I gotta keep Tunisia, if I can. <clears throat> so I'm gonna use this to clear out stuff behind me. And I have to break with this. I... Yeah, this is not good. <clears throat> Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. And I have to give up this cap so red doesn't go in me from behind. White's gonna get 13. And that's okay. But also, white is gonna set in, right? This is... This is like turn 5 and it's only a 3-player endgame. It's a tough one. I had to give up my cap. I had to get a different position for me.
I think White has enough to just uh, maybe I think he does. Red needs to hit White too. Red needs to hit White. He's going for Scandinavia. White is definitely the better player than Red. So he's still getting 21. Oh boy. Yeah, he can just take my cap here. White just bought it. What the hell? What the hell? White just bought it, guys. Huh? What the hell? Use the three horses, so three horses are getting back into the deck or pool. Whatever you want to call it. Make sure we get down here. You can use your arrow keys to quickly switch the dices. And we are gonna sit here for a brief moment. That's a good roll for me. I have a set on three. And red pulled 20 back somewhere here, right? Okay. I need to kill the bot on my next turn. Oh. Hope it doesn't set. I need to get more coffee after this. We can count the dice if he cleared him. You see the dice here, the attacks. He needs to do two more to get Spain. He has Spain now. Is that all he does? Also, the way bots work, bots can set as soon as they can. So they're gonna sit on four cards. 
I think we see all of the bots right now. We are gonna double set. Let's check what's up here. <laughs> Usually you don't wanna slam this kind of troops. Oh, red lost C cup again. Nice, nice. Look for some good pathing. Oh, I messed it up, huh? I messed up the pathing. I messed up the pathing. Ah, oh, I messed it up. I messed up my pathing. Oh, damn it. I'm bad. I'm sorry. As I said, I'm looking for perfect pathing. I messed it up. And I give four cards to red. That was really bad. Don't do that, guys. Don't do that. Don't try this at home. <laughs> Don't try this at home. Don't forget to get four cards just by a single territory. Yikes. Luckily, red is slow. And doesn't realize. Better lucky than good that this guy is French. No kappa. <laughs> I think he doesn't realize how to play progressive. You always want to kill people when they are on four cards and sets are high. No, he does it. He does it. No, he doesn't do it. Oh my God. What? And the bot does not set on four. <laughs> what the hell? Well. It was all planned, guys. It was all planned. <laughs> well, we just run it back and when you kill someone for the cards and you set in again, you get another additional 30 seconds of turn timer. So you want to use that as much as possible. Oh my god. Better than lucky than good, huh? Let's see what is on the Iceland cap. It's only a 5. Give him the GG, even though he is probably new and didn't understand how the progressive cards work. It is what it is. Better lucky than good, huh? Okay, let's see the rank. Probably expert. Whoa. Okay, better than I thought. Intermediate. Okay. Well, I'm going to get myself some cup of coffee and go next.